I was recently reflecting with a friend about the impact that COVID has had on people and communities up and down the country. I don't know about you, but I get most of my energy, the vast majority of my energy, from being around other people. So I found myself absolutely exhausted during the lockdowns and having to take naps during the day just to make up for the lack of people contact that I've had. Now, Carmen and I feel really fortunate to be at St Matthew's, where we have felt really welcomed by you all, um, but it hasn't come without its challenges. Getting to know people with uh, half their face covered behind a mask, or trying to recognise people that you met on Zoom can be difficult. And so if I've got you confused with somebody else or struggle to remember a name, then I apologise, hopefully in advance. Now, it is clear that we have a great community here at St Matthew's, and this is actually one of our greatest evangelistic tools that we can um, use to our advantage. Ellie Mumford, who is one of the senior leaders of the Vineyard Church in the UK and Ireland, um, once observed that people may go to a church, may visit a church for a number of reasons, but there's generally only one reason that they'll stay, and that is that they make friends. Now, in the lead up to Christmas, why don't we really focus on inviting people to come along, maybe to a carol service or to one of the services that we have here each Sunday. Don't forget that we also have the current Alpha course um, running this term. It's never too late to invite somebody to Alpha. And the next course is due to start in January. Don't worry, I'm definitely uh, speaking to myself at the same time speaking to you about this. Anyway, that's enough from me. I hope you have a really lovely week and I look forward to seeing you at the weekend.